Hello, today I'm going to show you how to connect MobiLink to a heart device using FieldMate. We're actually going to be using one of Yokogawa's books to do this. The first things you're going to want to do is come to the Softing MobiLink website. Uh, so if you simply Google Softing and MobiLink, come to our website, go to the downloads. You're going to want to download the MobiLink DTM and then you'll want to update your DTM catalog on your DuraBook. That's all you really need to do to get started with MobiLink is just download the heart DTM and have it on your DuraBook. You're also gonna to wanna to connect your MobiLink in this configuration as shown. So you're gonna to wanna to have your 24 volt supply for your heart device with your, your heart resistor is 250 ohms typically and then you can connect the MobiLink with the cables that come with it directly to the screw terminals on the back of that heart device. Today I'm going to be connect connecting to a Yokogawa EJA device. Um, the MobiLink can then be connected to your DuraBook via USB or Bluetooth. So once you've completed that you're going to want to come into your um, FieldMate software. You're going to want to go to Tool and pick FDT project and we'll say new FDT project and that's going to open up the FDT DTM works. Once this loads you're going to want to add your MobiLink device so you come to new and you'll right click on it. Add, go to heart, add that device so that's using that heart DTM we just downloaded. You're also going to need the, the heart DTM for whatever type of field device you're connecting to. Um, in my case, like I said previously, it's going to be an EJA Yokogawa transmitter. So I'll come underneath it, say add, go down to the particular DTM for my device, click it, add it as well, and then I need to connect. So I'll connect to my MobiLink and then I'll also connect to that EJA device. Once I've connected, I can now click on it and do online parameterization for it. And so it'll take a little bit to load that DTM file and compile all that for our communication. And you see it's now loaded. Um, so you can come in here and this is where you can configure your device and do different things with it. So I can go to process variables if I want to see what the process variables are it, and it loads those variables that we're getting from the transmitter itself. That's it for how to connect the MobiLink to a heart device using FieldMate.